Hi everyone, I saw a lot of questions about why we have 225 Paragon points in our Maxwell builds, for example. So recently we played the early access and I made my video talking about how I have found all of the Altars of Lilith. And well, it turns out we do get some extra Paragon points from those now. So this is quite of a novelty. I think this was not present in the game previously, at least not from anything that we have seen or from leaks and anything like that. So previously the assumption was that you would get 221 Paragon points with the first one unlocking when you reach level 50 and then you have 50 levels of 4 points per level so that's 201 and then 20 from Renown. So this was the original 221 points. If you have seen me theory crafting and making builds for example here for my Discord I have um, yeah, my channel here with a bunch of builds that have fully completed Paragon setups that I made with this website here default-builds.gg now I'm slowly going to move that over to uh, Max Roll um, Builder, I guess. But uh, here are some of these builds where I also just used 220. But it was already clear that it would be 221. Now you actually get four more points from those Altars of Lilith. And interestingly, they're all in the same zone quite close to each other. So this is Dry Steps. And you see here, those are the four Altars that give you the plus one Paragon point each. So if you don't want to go around the entire world and explore everything and collect all the Altars, then you definitely want to pick up those at least. So once you level 50, you start out with extra Paragon points and they do add up. So once you start unlocking the Renown, once you have those Altars, you know, it just feels a lot better. You suddenly have like, you know, half a board, you know, further progressed than you otherwise would have if you don't have these things. And Paragons, you know, at the end, when you try to min-max are definitely quite valuable. So make sure you get those very early. And what it means for the theory crafting part of things. So if you have your old builds like already prepared or something like that with less points, now, well, you get five free points or four free points at least. And most of the time you may be able to just pick up some more magic notes or, or something like on the way that you previously skipped because you didn't really have enough points to get in everything, but now you can. So something to keep in mind, more free stuff basically. And that's it for this little video. Hope you enjoyed it. Wish you good luck on the launch. And see you guys next time.